Hello, my name is Thomas Borick. I'm a teacher here at Renaissance Charter School at Hunters Creek. Thomas Borick. He is one of our math teachers since 2016. Prior to coming to Renaissance Charter School, he was a high school teacher in Osceola County. I teach algebra and I teach middle school mathematics. Uh, I started here about three years ago. Prior to teaching here, I taught in Osceola County for several years. Mr. Bork is not just a teacher. He holds a bachelor's degree in chemical engineering. I'm a graduate of New Jersey Institute of Technology up in Newark, New Jersey. I received my bachelor's degree in chemical engineering. As a chemical engineer, he worked for several different companies, such as the R&D department of Avon Products in New York, Philip Morris Research Center in Virginia, and in Inmont Corporation in New Jersey. My, my engineering career actually started while I was still in college. I was lucky enough to secure employment during the summers between semesters working for Avon Cosmetics. I worked at their R&D center in Suffern, New York. Afterwards, my first job after graduation was with Philip Morris Research and Development Center in Richmond, Virginia. So I interviewed and was hired by Inmont Corporation up in Newark, New Jersey. And that company is one of the largest producers of automobile paint, printing ink, and textile dyes. So my experiences there were very varied and I, I actually got quite an education in different industrial processes. After that, Boric found what would be his career for the next 28 years, industrial water treatment with ChemTreat Inc. My responsibilities at ChemTreat included keeping my clients' industrial equipment that used water, keeping that equipment clean, free of scale and corrosion and biological contamination. So my clients ranged from, from industrial plants to hospitals to educational facilities, just about everybody that used any kind of steam generating equipment or industrial air conditioning, which is water-cooled. Once retired, Warwick felt he needed to do something with his experience, so he made the decision to share his knowledge with the generation that is growing up, students. Engineers, by definition, are problem solvers. That's what we do. And an engineering education can lead to success in other careers as well, such as medicine, law, the military, and teaching. I retired early, and I was home, and I was bored, and I had not much to do, and for all my life, I was busy every day, and I, I was advised to become a teacher. And at first, I thought, no, that would never work, but I also, I'm always willing to try something new, so I secured a position as a substitute teacher in Osceola County and it only took a few months for me to really enjoy what I was doing. So I applied for certification and I received it and I spent quite a few years between teaching and substitute teaching as the situation demanded. But ultimately I, I, was, in, I was invited to come here and I, I followed up on that and I was hired. As a teacher at RCHC, Oric has been rewarded by seeing his students achieve growth and success. I'd really like to plant that seed in, in the minds of my students that may blossom into a career for them. It's very enjoyable for me to find a student enjoying what he's doing and enjoying what he's learning. And my, 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 my reward is when that light bulb lights up and I hear that Wow, yeah, I get it. That makes me feel really good because it means that I was effective and I passed on what I learned. See, I, I try to teach the way I was taught. And I, I was really, I enjoyed many, many, many very good teachers. 
and their styles were all different but I was able to pick and choose the best parts of all of them and I try to combine that when I teach a lesson. And what I really want to, want, want to happen one day is I want to turn on that television or pick up the newspaper and see a young man or woman being awarded for their accomplishments and recognizing them and being able to say, you know, I taught that person when they were a student at Renaissance Charter School at Hunters Creek. Thanks to Mr. Warwick, our students have the opportunity to take advanced math classes, such as algebra, which will increase their ability to complete when they start in high school.